Well, there's something you don't see every day either. Some kind of a pen from the local hospital. I've never seen one of those anywhere. Anyway, cool. It's a cool find. It's pretty neat. They're still pretty cool. I've dug all kinds of these different ones, but I don't think I've ever dug one quite like this. It's got a neat design on it. It'll still look good in the case. Great for the display case. I probably won't display it like that. I'll probably display it like that. It just looks better. Cool. Well, I got me a Watsit here. I uh, don't know if that's mother of pearl or not. Thanks for the car. I'm sure that's not real gold on the side. It's a top button to something. It's a button to something. Uh, not like a coat button, but a regular button, I assume. Um, I don't know. Somebody else has to tell me what that one is, because that one there is kind of a mystery to me. So I'll keep it. Maybe it's something cool. I don't know. Let me know if you know what that is. Man, you know, you do your research and you go somewhere thinking, yeah, I'm going to find something. And then you do. That's great. The bad thing about it, about it is you don't pay attention because you're so excited that you mess up the whole video because you didn't record it right. And you didn't check it. So what you did is, is in the past. So I didn't get to dig. I mean, I got the coin when it first came out of the ground, but the video was so bad that I can't even use it. So I got it after it was cleaned up a little bit. And uh, check this out. I'm not going to clean it up anymore until I get home. But you can see, it's an 1847. And that makes this trip completely worth it. You would never believe where I'm sitting in the middle of town to find this I think it'll clean up pretty good it's just coated with stuff so I think when I get that home as you can tell all I did was just use a little bit of spit in my finger and it's gonna come out pretty decent so I'll get that home here in a little bit and clean that dude up now let's see what Tim let's see what Tim thinks about this large scent you know he's been wanting one for a long time I don't think he believed that he could have dug one in the town here, but uh, it's possible. I mean, if you do your research and know where you're going, it's definitely possible. So uh, let's see what he says about this one. This should be pretty good. Here, look at this one. This one's clean enough to where you can see what it is. Ready? It's on your bucket list. Oh, don't tell me it's on my bucket list. Yeah! Large it, baby! Woo! In town. In town. Hey, look at that. Well, you told me he was going to come in and move, clean the town out. There it is. Oh, my gosh. Pre-Civil War, man. 1847, baby. Mm. Come up like a penny? Like copper? Yeah. Uh, you got to let me lay this down. I haven't, I haven't cleaned it yet. I just cleaned it enough with some spit just to see what year it was. 47. Oh, my gosh. In town. I don't know exactly what that is, but that thing is heavy. And it's right here where I dug that large scent. Check that out. What's that? I don't know what it is, but it's mine and it's cooler than hell. Ah, oh, sure is. I know what it represents sash. You know, maybe it's like a curtain sash. It represents his S cord. Yeah, I bet you it was on an old curtain sash or Somebody something. Somebody cut it. What's it made of? I don't know. It's heavy. I say brass, maybe. Yeah, I think that's a good guess. That thing is heavy, isn't Come it? Up like brass? Yeah. That's pretty cool right there, man. Oh my god. This doesn't happen. I almost didn't dig this, but I heard it. Just barely chirping. And boys and girls, is that a piece of. Oh, I thought it was a. I so thought that was a large. Or a. Uh, yeah, whatever I'm talking about. I thought that was a. Morgan. But I have no idea what this is. 
I'm gonna, it's a big token of some kind. So, good luck token? I don't know, let me see. Well, this is all I can think. This guy used to be, this house was the original place of a ship captain. And if you read that, it says the Lithonia or whatever right there. The only way, and my hand's shaking so bad, I don't know if you can read it. But at the top it says something about using this, I don't know. And you flip it over, and you see member, ship, something about a, a club. I'm not real sure, but there's that ship name again, Mercenthaler. So I say it's some kind of a member, if you was a, sh a member or a part of the crew to that ship, you got one of these tokens. It's not dated, but it's heavy, man, and it's the size of a silver dollar. And I really thought it was when I first dug it. So if anybody else has any knows anything about it, I would love to know what it is. It's pretty cool though. Pretty stinking cool. That thing is sweet, man. Sure is. So I cleaned it up and I looked at it and What's what another I, one of them uh No. Mm -mm. What I think that really is is I dug that on a piece of property where he was a boat captain. And if you read that stuff, I think that is a, a token, like a member token of that actual ship. If you look at it and read it, it's really cool. Does this does it say work, don't work club? Yeah. Don't work club. But it also says something about a member or something too. Merson Taylor. I've never seen the word Merson Taylor before. I know. I wonder if it's some kind of a... Merson Taylor? Mm-hmm. Wait a minute. Yeaman? No. Member. It's a member. Membership. Yeah. Membership. What's that word there? C-H-O-L. I don't know. I, I gotta... I gotta... Clean it up more. Yep. Oh man, that is large. I thought it was a silver dollar when I flipped it over. Now! So I should have called you, huh? I could have been with you. You want to see something else? I thought you had to work. I did have to work today. Wait a minute, I'm not ready for something else. Alright. Because this one here is going to get you too. Oh man. This is a place where you said we should go. Yeah, here. Here, don't worry about well, thanks that. Thanks for calling me. I didn't know you was out. You worked last night. Yes, I did, but I got four hours of sleep. That'll clean what up. What's it say on this side, man? I don't know. I'd have to get it in there and clean it. I'd, I'd looked at it for a little while. The lithotype? The... Something only. Uh, man. Let me clean up more. Okay. So what I come to find out about this Mercenthaler token was it wasn't actually for a ship member. Uh, the first linotype was made in 1886 for the New York Tribune. And these tokens were made around the 20s uh, just for good luck advertisement whatever it is so it's still a good find I just wish it was something to do with that ship captain uh, or his boat or something like that while Tim's over there chasing something I want to show this sidewalk when they built this house look at that there's your marlin in that part come over to this section there's a frog I don't know what you'd call that thing. Pooh Bear? <laughs> I have no clue. But check this out. I told you this guy was a riverboat captain. Look at this. Put himself an anchor in there. And then you go down here to this one. And that's those, uh, what is it, those faces for uh, plays or whatever. I don't know what to call that, but I'm sure you know what I mean. And you come over to this piece here. And you get this. Thank you for turning that off. Get the elephant. And then you come down to the last one. And you get the Spartan. How cool is that, man? One, two, just those couple right there. 
So that's really cool. I just figure you guys like to see that. You know, large sense in this town, they're, they're pretty hard pulls. So when you get one, you have to be excited about it because they just don't come along that often. So yeah, if you couldn't tell, I was super excited. So uh, I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as uh, I did making it and finding all this stuff. Uh, until next time, good luck digging.